Hey everybody, welcome to the real United States and happy Independence Day as it turns out. Today is July 4th, 2018 and we are here at the Robert Taft Memorial in Carillon. Now Robert Taft, sculpted here behind me in this 10 foot tall statue by sculptor Wheeler, Wheeler Williams. I'll put that on the screen here for those of you that are interested. It's a 10 foot tall bronze statue uh, is in memorial, memorial of uh, the late Senator Robert Taft, uh, Robert Alfonso Taft, the son of William Howard Taft, the former President of the United States. And uh, behind him is this big stone carillon, a structure with a musical instrument made from bells inside of it. It's 100 feet tall, 11 feet forward aft, and 32 feet wide, and has 27 bells. Uh, the largest of them, uh, the, the big bell, it weighs seven tons. So uh, it's an impressive musical instrument. Um, it plays the Westminster chimes on the quarter hour, and of course rings out the hour, uh, every hour. Uh, but it only plays music, as I understand it, one time a year, just once a year. On July 4th at 2 p.m., it plays a variety of patriotic music, not the least of which is our Star Spangled Banner, our national anthem, which we have captured for you and I'm going to include at the end of the video. Now, Taft had an illustrious career. I'm not going to go into all the details about it, but he was known as a man of integrity. And whence this particular monument, uh, if you look at the inscription, says it is given by the people to the Congress uh, in honor of this senator. So, again, uh, he was a man of great integrity. Um, definitely had some differences with the sitting president. Um, Harry S. Truman at the time over Taft-Hartley. Uh, those are things that you, if you're interested in those, you may want to do some further research. Uh, I, I'm not going to bore everyone else with all the details of that. Uh, this monument, interestingly enough, at least interesting to me, uh, was placed here in April, April 14th of 1959. So just slightly more than four months before I was born. and. Uh, I suppose also interesting at that time there were 49 states because Alaska had gotten its statehood in January and Hawaii did not get its statehood until August. So it was dedicated here in that very brief period of time when there was 49 states. Uh, I don't know, I thought that was interesting. So Wheeler Williams um, did a beautiful, beautiful job with this. You know, Taft looks very, very well groomed, very, very stately, um, as a statesman should. Here, and the uh, the monument itself, this is a granite base, and what looks to be a marble structure around the Carillon, and this is in Upper Senate Park, just across from the literally across the street from the United States Capitol building and it is a huge um, area with granite um, railings if you will and all these beautiful colored pavers here steps that go down to the park and benches so this was an incredibly expensive endeavor to build even in 1959 and down around the edge there are fountains which for whatever reason are not operational at this time. Um, a lot of the fountains in DC around public works right now seem to be being serviced. Um, so maybe it's a thing they're doing them all at once. But at any rate, there are fountains to go around. So a very elaborate monument to Senator Taft. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the short visit. Don't go away. We're gonna play the carol on for you. We're here in just a moment. But I just wanted to say thank you for joining us. If you got questions or comments, leave them in the comments section down below. I love hearing from all of you. I try to get back to everybody I can. If you're new here, hey, fix subscribe. Come along for the adventure because we got lots more to show you. And as always, well, thank you for watching.